Hey you guys, it's Star. Thank you so much for tuning into the video. I hope you're having a good day or night whenever you are watching. So yes, yes, y'all, we're reporting live from Publix. It has been so many months since I have done a Publix haul, but Publix is actually one of my favorite places to coupon. I have not been making a lot of Publix videos lately because I know a lot of you guys don't have Publix, but you guys, these deals are on fire. So if you do have Publix and you enjoy Publix content, definitely support this video by giving it a thumbs up and letting me know down below in the comments. So without further ado, let's talk about these Publix deals. So this first deal that I did actually turned out to be a Publix promise situation. As you can see, these bags of yellow onions are marked for $1.99, but this is last week's sale and I did not know it. So when I saw this sale, I was like, oh, let me grab a bag of these. And it actually rang out for $3.99 at the register. But thankfully, due to the Publix promise, I ended up getting these for what? For free $99. If you're not familiar with the Publix promise, if the wrong sales tag is up and it rings out wrong at the register, you get that item for free. So free onions to get our trip started. Next thing I grabbed was some potatoes. So these were 89 cents per pound, but I also had an Ibotta rebate and I was trying to hit my midweek bonus. So these track towards that bonus because I had an any potato offer. So the Tina pads are truly the star of the show this week at Publix. I feel like the Tina has been the star of the show many weeks at Publix because of the great coupons and rebates that we have on these items. So these are $4.39 each after the $1 off sale. You can either pick up eight of them or you can pick up 10 of them. I'm going to go ahead and pick up eight of them and that is going to total me up to $35 and 12 cents. I'm going to be using four of the $5 off of two coupons. That'll deduct $20, leaving me to pay $15.12 at the register. Then I am going to submit back to checkout 51 for $16 in cash back, making them free plus about a $1 money maker. But then I'm also going to submit back to activate rewards since this is over $30 worth of Tina and I'm going to be getting back a $10 gift card, making eight of these free plus an over $10 money maker. Then we're going to grab some cheap snuggle. So these are on sale $3.99 BOGO. So they're each going to ring out for $1.99 each and half BOGO land. If you have to do the buy one, get one free true BOGO sale, then you want to pick up two of these. So I'm going to be picking up two and I'm going to be using two of the dollar and 50 cent coupons. We also have $1 printables. These are going to be just 50 cents each. Next up, I grabbed the Just Crack an Egg Omelette Round. So these are $3.79 at Publix, and Ibotta is giving back $3.49, making this item only $0.30. Cents. I also picked up the Challenge Butter, and I stocked up on this sale. So these are $2.69 BOGO when you buy two, and we have double savings to redeem for. So we do have a dollar off of two digital coupon. We also have $0.50 cent printable coupon coupons and we have 75 cent rebates on Ibotta. So when you buy two of these and use that 50 cents in coupon savings on each one plus get the dollar and 50 cents back on two from Ibotta, these come out to be just 10 cents each for butter, which is amazing. The Sargento Creamery Cheese is absolutely free this week. This is a great deal. These are priced at $2.50, and then Shopcake is giving back $1.50, and we have a $1 digital coupon. So after that $2.50 in coupon savings, one of these is free 99. The next freebie on my list is the Lipton Tea. So we got a lot going on with the Lipton this week. It is an amazing freebie. So you can grab two of these for as low as $1.79, buy one, get one free. We do have $1 printable coupons if you are signed up for the Lipton email list 
or you can also use the 40 cent insert coupons. And then these also track for our Fetch Rewards offer for spend 15, get five. And you may also have a $1 fetch rebate. I have a spin 10, get $2 fetch rebate. So I won't be doing that one today, but I am going to pick some of these up to get towards that $15 threshold so that I can get back $5 from fetch rewards. Another item I'm picking up is the Dove Hand Wash. So these are $2.99. And then we do have a two off of two digital coupon. And check your fetch rewards. We have either 75 cents back or a dollar and 25 cents back. If you have that dollar and 25 cents back, that'll make these just 75 cents. And they also track towards that spin 15, get five. The Thomas Anything English Muffins are the next item I picked up. So we have a dollar and 25 cents back on our bottle on these and they're on sale, buy one, get one free. So I live in Georgia where it's half BOGO. So I only have to pick up one of these and that will cost me $2.39. I'm going to submit back to Ibotta for a dollar 25 and I'm going to submit to Fetch Rewards for 20 cents. That's gonna make my final cost for these just 89 cents. The Simply Organic Spices are the next cheap item on my list, but I decided to pass on these this week because I was absolutely shooketh when I saw the price of these spices. When did spices get so high, y'all? Inflation is real. But these are gonna be $2.39 um, here, half price, because they're two for $4.79, buy one, get one free. We do have a dollar and 50 cent coupon, which will make it only 89 cents, but parsley is the only item that I see that would even be 89 cents, so I'm gonna pass this week. I was so excited when I saw this deal on the La La Chera sweetened condensed milk because I use these a lot at the holidays. So these are buy one, get one free $2.99. So one of them is gonna ring out for $1.49 for me. And then Shopkick is giving back a dollar and thirty-four cents, making this only sixteen cents. In order to hit my Ibotta bonus, I also grabbed some Kraft macaroni and cheese. This is also buy one, get one free this week. These are on sale for 60 cents a box. I submitted back for 20 cents on Ibotta, which made this just 40 cents. rice a is only 10 cents each. These are on sale two for $3, and we have double savings once again. So we have a two off of two digital coupon, and you can submit back for 40 cents on each one of them on Ibotta, making your final cost just 20 cents for two. The next deal I'm picking up is Free Hungry Jack Potatoes. So this is an extra savings flyer deal, so it's good until the 19th. These are on sale for a dollar a piece, four for four. We have $1 manufacturer coupons and making them completely free. So with as many Danimals as I bought today, you guys, you would think that I would have filmed myself picking them up, but I did not. But the Danimal smoothies, these are the kids' drinks. These are on sale, buy one, get one free this week. So two of them will total you up to $3.09. We do have $2 coupons, and that will give you $0.90 cents in overage, $0.91 cents to be exact in overage. So I did buy a ton of these today because I used that overage to reduce my out of pocket. The Rockstar Energy Drink was free after the free digital coupon and then I also picked up some cheap alkaline water. So this Jovi water is $2.49 regular price. I had a $1 digital and $1.25 back on Ibotta making it only $0.25. Cents. I also picked up a couple more produce items. I got some Brussels sprouts that were on sale two for $5.00. And I also picked up some limes that were four for a dollar. So I had this three off of 10 craft digital coupon and I wanted to see if it would work on two of these craft mayos since the regular price is $5 and some change each. It did not work, so I ended up aborting these right at the register. I left them right there since that digital did not come off. And since that expires today, you can just disregard that deal. So here's everything that I got in my cart. This is everything that I'm getting in my first transaction. And then after I check out with this, I'm going to go to a second store. 
So now we're at store number two. I just checked out my first transaction and I am in love with this money maker that we are about to get into. So these Focus Sparkling drinks are $2.49, but Checkout 51 is giving back $5.99. So these babies are gonna be free, plus a $3.49 cash money maker. The next thing I'm grabbing is the Breakstone Sour Cream. So Ibotta is giving me back 75 cents on these and I have a $1 digital coupon. The regular price is $2.39. So these are only gonna be 64 cents and it gives me one more rebate towards my bonus. The Excedrin is a deal that I'm gonna pass on this week, but this is a pretty good situation if you need it. So these are $4.99 and we do have a $2 digital coupon and we have a $2 Publix coupon and the extra savings flyer, making these only 99 cents. Then I'm gonna grab one of these Gold Bond lotions because I absolutely love Gold Bond. These are pretty expensive. This little tube is $6.49. But we do have triple savings to redeem for. So we have a $2 Publix coupon and we have a $2 manufacturer coupon and Ibotta is giving back $1.50. So we're gonna save $5.50, bringing down the cost all the way to 99 cents. The Pillsbury items are the next item on my list. These are $1.99 BOGO. So three of them are gonna total me up to $3. I'm gonna be using a dollar off of three digital coupon that's gonna make them just 67 cents each. The Afresh is a nice money maker. You wanna grab the garbage disposal cleaners. These are $2.99 BOGO, so two of them will total you up to $2.99. You want to use the $1 manufacturer coupon and submit back for a dollar on Ibotta, making each one of these a 50 cent money maker. So these meatballs, the Rosina meatballs are $8.99 BOGO. I picked up one bag for $4.50 since I am and have BOGO land. We do have a $1.75 coupon that I forgot to clip, it's a digital. And we also have a dollar back on Ibotta, making these just $1.49 for the bag. The chapstick is free. We have a $1 store coupon and we have a $1 digital coupon. The store coupon is in the extra savings flyer. So use both of those. These are going to be free plus 21 cents in overage. And then the final item that I'm grabbing is the garden veggie straws. So these are $3.99 BOGO. So I'm picking up two for $3.99. I'm going to be using two of the $1 printable coupons and I'm going to be submitting back to Ibotta for 50 cents, making two bags of these just 75 cents each. All right, you guys, so this is gonna be my second transaction. So I did pick up a couple extra items. One, I picked up some half and half, just because these look like they were gonna be on a shortage come Thanksgiving, based on the signs that were up. And I also picked up some tortillas that I found on clearance. These were two for $2.69, and I had a dollar off of two digital coupon. So let's go check out with this final card, and then we will see how everything worked. All right, you guys, so I am back at home and this is my complete Publix haul for today. You guys, we got well over $200 worth of groceries and household items and I just made $10 in cash profit from this haul. So I'm gonna go over both of my receipts. I went to two different stores and I did a couple different transactions. So let me show you the breakdown for both of these receipts because they were very interesting. So I'm gonna show you the smaller haul first cause that's easier to just get out the way. So I'm gonna put a picture up on the screen of the haul that this receipt is for. So this was a super small haul. In this transaction, I did everything except for the two challenge butter. I took those off and did those separately so that I could use those on my husband's Ibotta account, but everything else you will see on this receipt. So the wind is blowing a little bit out here, so I'm gonna put the digital version of my receipt up on the screen so you can see how everything rang out. That trip was pretty uneventful. My subtotal came up to 1841. We had a total savings of 7525 for that transaction. So after paying that 1841, I did get back a total of 2099, just about $21 from all of the rebate apps. I got back $10 from Ibotta because I did hit my midweek moneymaker bonus with that 
at receipts. So I had a total of 15 offers completed in this haul. And then I also got back $5 from Fetch Rewards because between all of the tea and the Dove hand soap, I did spend the $15 required to get back five there. And I also got back $5.99 for the Focus from Checkout 51. That was an awesome moneymaker, $3.49 in cash profit. Since those were on clearance for $2.49, giving back $5.99. So now let me show you my second haul, which is really the first haul that I did, the bigger transaction. This was a big daddy haul. It was well over $100. And then we brought it all the way down to $40 and some change. I think $42, somewhere around there. And I knew that $42 was a little bit high. So I had to check my receipt to see what I missed on that receipt. On that receipt, I had a couple issues. The first one is the onions that we went over. So they still had up the tag from last week's sale. And so I was able to get those onions for free with the Publix Promise. So they did refund me $4.11 from the onions. And then I also had to get a refund of about $3.50 for missing coupons. So somehow I forgot my two $1 coupons for the Lipton in that transaction. And I also forgot my $3.50 coupons for the Challenge Butter. So the true total for that transaction was actually $34.86 after I did get back that $7.50 something cents in my refund. So $34.86 for that transaction and I got back over $42 for that transaction. So I'm getting back $26 for the Tina. I already got $16 from Checkout 51 and then we are submitting back to Activate Rewards for $10 in cash back there in a Publix gift card. Then I also got back $11.69 from Ibotta, and I also got back $2.60 from Fetch Rewards, and I also got back some money from um, Shopkick. I got back $2.60. So after spending that $34.86 for that big transaction, I got back a total of $42.89, which made that transaction about free plus an $8 moneymaker. So when you combine that $8 moneymaker and that $2 moneymaker from my other transaction, this was a $10 moneymaker haul. In this trip, I spent out around $53 and I'm getting back over $63 um, in some change for this haul, which I think is amazing. So definitely a great week to shop at Publix this week. Please let me know if you have any questions. Please remember to hit that thumbs up button and subscribe if you have not already. I would love to have you here. I thank you all so, so much for watching today's video. And as always, you guys, I will talk to you soon. Bye. Bye, you guys.